based on the documentation of national not available disease surveillance, a total of 1.03 million cases of red urinary tract disease were recorded globally. Meanwhile, in Malaysia, the highest number of cases were recorded in 2014 with a total of 7,806 cases and 92 deaths. Is it true or not? that these efforts requires rat poison to control the populations of rat that are the main carriers of this rat urine disease. Unfortunately, the existence of rat poison that we are widely used contain chemicals that are harmful to other pets as well as humans. Chemicals such as zinc, prosphite and brodifecum have been studied to be harmful to life. Zinc phosphide has an estimated lethal dose of 40 million grams per kg, while body fecum has an estimated lethal dose of 1.02 mg per kg. 20 cows died due to rat poison poisoning in Kulai Johor, proving that rat poison can harm consumers if taken in high dose. Not only cows, but also wildlife such as monkey and snakes were found dead to the poison around the farm this area. With three problems, we come up with a solution to innovate rat poison that can control rat populations, be not harmful to other animals or human, and environmentally friendly at the same time. With this, we present to you Coco Rodenticide. Coco Rodenticide is in the form of small pellets. This product is placed on the rat's pathway close to its nest or feeding area. When rats eat this poison, corncobs and soy wax act as a dehydrator. Corncobs are also able to absorb fluid in the intestines, which will cause low blood pressure, thickening of blood vessels, and circulatory problems. Giving cocorodenticide in certain doses can kill rats. Rat carcasses will be found around the house after a few days. And believe it or not, these carcasses won't smell because of the dehydrated rats. From our observation, we decided to reduce the size of the bottle, yet the amount of cocorodenticide pellet found in the bottle is still at standard rates. Cocorodenticide is sold at the price of 4 ringgit, as the profit rate is taken as much as 100% of the cost expenses. Moving on to commercialization potential, our product offers some advantage. First, rat population and the smell of rat carcass can be controlled. Next, area cleanliness and consumer health are guaranteed. Besides that, our product is environmentally friendly because we use agricultural waste that adds value to agricultural waste, such as corn cobs, which is easy to dispose of. Other than that, no other pollution will be created. As you know, we are not the first person to produce this organic rat poison. Stick to the statement, nothing is perfect. Our product also has some drawbacks, such as our product takes quite a long time, mostly 5 to 7 days to show its effects. Next, its function is slightly affected if exposed to water or moist areas, as it can cause fungal growth on the poison. Lastly, as you know, Organic red poison is less popular in Malaysia. Thank you.